Hey everyone, some years budgets can be really exciting with sweeping tax cuts or dramatic gestures, but this year it was pretty dull apart from the Ferrari about the tax rise for self-employed people. And why self-employed people? Uh, but then you read how George Osborne is going to be earning well over half a million pounds selling himself to various organisations, and you wonder if Philip Hammond's maybe just setting up a deliberate trap for his predecessor. I've not looked into the detail at the back of the budget, but I'd love to know if there's a special levy in political speeches or ex-cabinet ministers in particular. Um, it is largely storm in a teacup though it's a pound or two per week and when i'm not doing these videos i'm self-employed myself um, and in all honesty whilst annoying i do also wonder if it's maybe a price worth paying after all every minute of radio 4 that's taken up with backbenchers discussing white vans will be a minute that won't have to be used to discuss brexit and every time they wheel at an economist to discuss ni contributions on the news it means a, a whinging policy advisor will have to stay at home and keep their views on alcohol and exercise to themselves um, in the meantime, well, it was also International Women's Day this week, uh, although from what I saw on the telly, most of the supposedly international women were in fact British, um, or as Nicola Sturgeon would pronounce it, English, uh, before adding treacherous and demanding a referendum in very much the same way that my little boy demands more toast in the mornings. Anyway, see you next week, and if you like these, click subscribe.